Hey, I'm Dan Delaney, and I'm traveling the world tasting the best street food around. Today we're in the Hayes Valley District of San Francisco, and I'm joined by my buddy Dave Morin of Facebook, and we're gonna check out one of the most social things in the world, coffee, right here on Vendor TV. So we're headed over to the Blue Bottle Coffee Kiosk. Um, it's one of like my favorite coffees in the world. It's one of the best coffees in the world. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. And we thought that, you know, coffee is inherently social. People congregate around cafes, and I think Facebook is like the most social thing on the web, so having Dave here is just the perfect marriage. Coffee is one of my favorite things. Uh, I'm in love with chocolate and mochas and, you know, the amazing different coffees that you can get all over the world, and Blue Bottle just happens to be one of the best. Is that what you're gonna check out today? I a might, mocha? I, absolutely. We'll have to check it out. All right, let's do it. So I ordered a macchiato, uh, which is sort of like two shots of espresso and a little bit of like a, a foam on the top of it. Uh, I got your standard mocha, uh, single shot, best thing in the world. It's pretty good. Is it good? Yeah, it's uh, it's 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 incredible. The uh, the, the the coffee is strong. Um, the chocolate, you can you can taste it pretty well. Sometimes when you get a mocha, the chocolate overpowers the coffee, or the coffee is just not strong enough. Um, and you don't really get the coffee buzz that you want, but Blue Bottle always delivers the, you know, the perfect combination of both. All right, so you enjoy your coffee, and give me one second, we're gonna go talk to the owner, okay? All right, have fun, man. So we're here with James at the Blue Bottle Kiosk. Thank you for having us today. You're welcome. Could you talk to me a little bit about um, how you got into coffee? I was a farmer's market shopper, super into food, and I was an admirer of the, the small and artisanal. Um, and so when I would uh, think about what sort of coffee business I wanted to have, it was very much the model that I could understand. Yeah. I had no business background, no coffee background. So I very much started with an ignorance is bliss kind of uh, approach. Yeah. Um, still haven't quite written a business plan, but you know, I will. Talk to me a little bit about this location and the community around it and how you decided to open up in sort of a garage. Well, um, it sounds kind of very premeditated, but I knew the guy that, op that owned this building, Loring, and I didn't have money to open a cafe. Cafes are expensive. And the, the regulatory environment in which we operate here is more like a coffee cart. Uh, uh, so it's a vendor, a street vendor on private property. And so Loring had this garage that fronted a peace-smelling alleyway that was dead-end at the time. And, you know, we opened with very minimal budget. And um, people kind of thought we were crazy because, you know, it's not on a main street. All the things we're supposed to do, we didn't do. Um, but the drinks were very solid um, and the staff was very good. And then it, people just kind of started coming by. You know, I, I appreciate you chatting with me. Um, I, I wish you the best of luck if Blue Bottle goes even further, and, and of course with this kiosk. And, uh, and, and thanks, the, the coffee's fantastic. Thank you very much. So that, my friends, is Blue Bottle Coffee. Just delicious coffee in downtown San Francisco. Unbelievable mocha. Yeah. If you want to learn more about them, check them out at their website, bluebottlecoffee.net. If you want to learn more about Dave, visit davemorin.com. And if you want to check out our other episodes, visit us online at vendor.tv. As always, I'm Dan Delaney. This is Dave Morin, and we're encouraging you to eat the street. See you next time. It's actually like a 12th cup for the day, so I need to like, <laughs> I'm shaking, I gotta, gotta slow down, but it's, it's very delicious. It's the experience social, best thing in the world. <laughs> to being cheesy. Coffee is, <laughs> coffee is better with friends. <laughs>